EasyTall is a tolerance stack-up analysis solution that enables designers and engineers to quickly understand the impact of part and assembly variation on the fit and performance of their products. To create a tolerance stack-up, simply select the two items of interest, place the dimension for the nominal distance, select the components that will be participating in the stack-up, and define their mating features. EasyTall automatically takes care of the rest. The stack-up table on the right shows the details of the stack-up, including the components, features, and tolerances involved. The model area shows the associated dimension loop. Here, the nominal stack-up value is shown in black, and each of the contributing dimensions is shown in blue. The bottom of the EasyTall window shows a results graph for the chosen analysis type. EasyTall supports worst case, RSS, and generalized statistical studies using four of the most commonly used quality metrics, CPK, Sigma, percent yield, and defects per million opportunities. If the parts contain dimensions and tolerances that are semantically associated to the features used in the stackup, EasyTall will automatically build the stackup loop using those tolerances for the easiest workflow possible. Tolerances that are linked to the CAD model are identified with a chain link icon. Clicking on this chain link icon will break the link to the tolerance definition in the part, allowing you to edit the tolerance type or value as you explore opportunities to improve the design. Clicking the icon again will restore the link and revert the tolerance back to the model-driven value. If the part features participating in the stackup do not have associated dimensions or tolerances in the model, EasyTall will automatically define dimensions between those features using specified default tolerance values. When editing a dimension, you can choose any tolerance type, including symmetric and asymmetric plus-minus formats, limits, and geometric tolerances. Precision is changed by adding or removing digits. Tolerances can be entered in either field, and EasyTall automatically corrects a location based on sign and value. Even defining geometric tolerances, including material modifiers and datums, is simple. Users without a deep understanding of gd and can still easily determine the impact that such choices have on their designs. A second tab below the stack-up table shows an ordered contributions diagram of all the dimensions that have an impact on the stack-up results, helping you to quickly focus your efforts to improve the design. Hovering over any of the items, either in the contributions plot or in the stack-up table, will highlight the associated item in the model area. We can complete the analysis by capturing some images using the snapshot tool and then running a report. The report will include an image of the dimension loop, the stack-up table, results graph, and contributions graph. Of course, most of your designs will require multiple stack-ups. As you work, each one will be added to the results summary table. It includes the objective and type for each stack-up, a quality assessment for RSS and other statistical analyses, the number of dimensions involved in the loop, and a visual cue to quickly see whether the objective for each has been achieved. At the bottom of the window is a simple summary of the results of all of the analyses in that model. Selecting any one of the stack-up results in the top shows the results graph for that selected stack-up at the bottom. Expanding one of the results switches to the detail view of the stack-up table, where you can continue to make changes to the selected stack-up. Any dimensions that are included in more than one stack-up will be flagged so that you know that changes made to improve the current stack-up will impact others. Hovering over the icon will list each of the stack-ups in which that dimension appears. If you've ever created spreadsheets to keep track of these relationships, you'll certainly appreciate the power and simplicity of EasyTall. EasyTall only performs one-dimensional stack-up analyses, but it detects scenarios where 1D treatment may be insufficient. When such scenarios are identified, it adds a caution symbol to the results row, as well as a note in the graph indicating the calculated 1D results are ignoring potentially significant 3D effects. Users can then decide whether or not to use more advanced tools like CETOL Six Sigma to get a better understanding of how the design will actually behave. No other solution available on the market today combines the ease of use of EasyTall with a visual indication of its own limitations. For more information or to get a trial of EasyTall, please visit our website at easytall.com.